Kyle Sang. I'm here to do your daily messages for Thursday, was it the 8th or the 9th? The first day of this week, 2021. Okay, messages for Aries. Okay, you have, you are not alone. We are here for you, we never left. Though all the sadness and loneliness, however, you cannot sense us near you or feel how much love we are sending you. We are your family, friends and guides. You never walk alone, we walk right beside you. That's nice, so, yeah. So if you've got um, passed over loved ones, or friends or guides they are with you at all times they are watching you they are protecting you they're right beside you okay you've got find your center your outside world is a reflection and a manifestation of what's going on inside you at this time when the outside world becomes so hectic and stressful that your anxiety starts to overwhelm you then this is an ideal moment to stop and ask when was the last time I checked in with myself you have a father's love. A father's love for his son or daughter never dies. The strength gained from such love is often unacquaintable. Unacquaintable? Nope. <laughs> Unquantifiable. Unquantif Sorry, my apologies. In that, it can be tucked into any time for whatever reason, whether your father is still here or past. A father's love is one of the strongest bonds any of us will ever experience. I can vouch for that. My father raised me. You've got breathe. Okay, the breath is a vital bridge between your body and self. It's the connection between the inside and outside connecting to the universe, spirit and divine source. The breath permeates your entire being with, I think that says prana. Can't read it, it's so small. If any of you can read that, zoom in. Whatever that says, I think it is prana. Which is the same life giving force that nourishes everything in the universe. Okay, let's get some more messages from my lovely Aries. Okay. Okay, I choose love no matter what. Obstacles and detours in the right direction. And you have, in every moment, the universe is conspiring to bring me towards right-minded thinking and the energy of love. Okay, let's see what the Romance Angels has for you, Aries. Aries, are you very tired at the moment? Because I'm feeling quite drained. Okay. You have let go of control issues. Allow this situation to unfold naturally. You have attraction you attract romantic love by enjoying this moment fully. Pay attention to the red flags. The signs are cautioning you. Have healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Have wedding. This situation involves marriage. Let your friends help you. Ask for and accept support from others. It is safe for you to love. Open your heart and give and receive the highest energy of all. And there's your messages, Aries. And let's go on to Taurus. Messages for Taurus. Have one more, please. Okay, give me a screen. Okay. You have synchronicity. Are you noticing the signs of synchronicity that the spirit world has been sending you at this time? People and situations in your life are not just appearing by coincidence. In reality, they are being guided to you from the spirit world to help you for a specific reason. Okay, you have trust, Taurus. While your logical mind is dictating a supposedly clear direction, your soul's inner guidance is urging you to follow your alternative path. The logical path may be one that you consider safe and more familiar, but you could be missing out on boundless opportunities and so much more. You have support. 
People come into your life for many different reasons. Some you learn from and then they move on, while others return often because you need to learn from those individuals. Others maintain, sorry, others remain beside you throughout your entire life. You have hope. Your loved ones in the spirit world know when to reach out if they see you're at a low point. Whether you're caught up in a difficult situation or struggling with someone specific in your life, there is always hope. Okay, that jumped out for you, Taurus. We'll have those. The moment I embrace my peace within and surrender the outcome is the moment that the universe can truly get to work. The key to prayer is to forget what I think I need. Romance Angels. Messages to Taurus. Have one more. Thank you. Okay, you have love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. You have engagement. Your love life is ascending to a high level of commitment. Past life relationship. You have known each other before. This could be the one. You've already met the romantic partner you seek. Quite nice. Nice reading for you there, Taurus. Okay, Gemini's. Messages for Gemini. Have one more, please. One more for Gemini. Being stubborn, Gemini. Okay, you've got caregiver. We are with you and spirit has its own way of recognising the care and the love you provide for others, especially at the end of their lives. Just as you received care and love at the start of your life, caregivers often focus all their attention on their loved ones and often neglect their own concerns and well-being in the process. So there's something I know about Geminis. There's that. <laughs> Bless their heart. They do a hell of a lot. They don't stop moving. They are very hard workers. You've got to take a moment. Stop. Now is not the time to rush into the decision you're about to make. Before this important decision is made, take a moment to pause and quiet your mind so that you can ask your soul for guidance before you act or move forward. I'm getting a love situation here for you, Geminis. You've got dream talk. Your subconscious constantly and subtly speaks through your dreams. It's just one of the many ways in which your soul and those here in the spirit world can reach out and communicate with you through signs, symbols, messages and more. So you could be getting a lot of signs and synchronicities at the moment, Gem. A couple of messages for Gemini's, please. Okay. I honour how I want to feel. Through prayer and meditation, I create a ripple effect of peace in the world. When I lean on certainty and faith, I change my mind about the world I see. When I lean on the faith of the universe, peace becomes real. Some good messages for you there, Gems. Okay. Messages for Gemini. Unfortunately, you have soulmate in reverse, so this would have been your soulmate. <laughs> Take this how it resonates. You've got flirt, extend your light-hearted energy to others. Are you having trouble with the past soulmate gems? Is that why it's in reverse? Okay, you have you deserve love, you are lovable. You are worth waiting for, divine timing is at work in your love life. Okay, Gems, that was your reading. Cancer. I'm sorry, just doing a time check. Yep. Cancers. I get two more for Cancer. Okay, thank you. <clears throat> okay, you got four, Cancer. You got Inspire Passion. Life devoid of passion can be boring, uninspired, blank canvas that slowly drains the soul. Now is the time to reignite your passions and rejoin life. 
This is an opportunity to set new goals, which will turn, re which will in turn reconnect you with all that is sacred. This felt very spiritual. I like that. You got hello from heaven. Your loved ones in the spirit world want to connect with you as much as you want to connect with them. They know you have been thinking of them and they're sending you signs and symbols to show you how much they love you to prove that they're with you at this time. Now I'm actually getting a channeled uh, message here as well. There is a, fe uh, a female spirit here. Oh dear. She doesn't want you to mourn her anymore. Um, she's quite happy. But she also, she doesn't want you to drink. She says you need light in your life. Open your curtains. Okay, that could be for any cancer out there. Okay, you've got just ask. There are many here in the spirit world that can assist you at this time. We are made up of the divine source, your loved ones, friends, guides, angels, and spirit helpers who are waiting to assist you. We are your spiritual team, and all you have to do is ask for our help and guidance. Last one you have is a child's love. The love between a parent and child is one of the most precious and deep connections we make during our time on earth. Children start out as a part of us and from their first cries they establish themselves as the biggest part of our hearts. The Cancer, you have children, please cherish. Love your children and they will love you back. So I know a lot of Cancers, there's a lot of uh, uh, Cancers in my family that make I'm going to say it, fucking great parents, they really do. Okay, messages for cancer. When I'm, when I'm in alignment with the love of the universe, peace cannot be disrupted. The presence of love will always cast out fear. My vibes speak louder than my words. I do whatever it takes to get closer to consciousness. When I focus on my inner light, I see the world through the lens of love. Oneness is my true nature. Okay, messages for cancer. Messages for cancer. Okay, you've got separation. Time apart from your partner is on the horizon. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. And then you have reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Okay, I'm going to have to leave this here and do uh, the rest of the signs later on. Okay, love you all. Please give us a like, share and subscribe.